Uh. Was always smart mouth and quick with it. But something was always missing like six. Yo, 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 what up? It's, it's just seven, awesome. Probably and as y'all know, E3 is so coming up pretty soon. Right. To be exact, I think E3 is coming in five days. So, what comes to E3 are the rumors. I'm more interested in Bethesda's rumors because I always expect the best from Bethesda. So, according to GameSpot, there was a rumor that there will be Skyrim Remastered ported to Xbox One and PlayStation 4. But I think they're going to continue on with the Fallout 4 legacy of adding mods to Skyrim. So, apparently, it's supposed to be boosted graphics and mods. Hopefully, they partner with Nexus because Nexus has like great mods for Skyrim. But I think that take a lot of effort on Bethesda's part because it's a whole different modding community because they mod for PC. So, one that's one of the rumors Skyrim Remastered. The second rumor is supposed to be. The Evil Within 2, which I'm looking forward to. Also, Prey 2, I've never heard anything about Prey. I, last time I actually ever heard the name of a game called Prey was basically yesterday. And that was when I was reading an article based on Prey 2 coming to consoles. They're also having Wolfenstein The New Order 2. And I'm pretty sure Wolfenstein The New Order 1 was like a fucking DLC because they sold it for like $15. But hey, I mean, but that's the only thing I do to make that money. At least with that's also entertains their fans. Are like Xbox always do some dumb fuck up shit. For example, was this E3 2012 2013 when they were saying that they were gonna quote unquote content lock this to certain consoles so you can't like trade with your friends and shit and their PlayStation came back with that funny ass commercial where it was like this is how you share your games on PS4 thanks PlayStation but um, hopefully Xbox don't do no fuck shit, and PlayStation, I hope they do some pretty good shit too. I'm really looking forward to see how fucking Activision gonna react to that stupid Infinite Warfare shit, and how they was gonna make you pay $80 so you could pay $60 for the game, and $20 for Modern Warfare 1 Remastered. They thought they were slick with that shit, but um, yeah, this laser is awesome, I'm out.